questions on, in, on his pasha to brawl with the real big hitters of the boxing ring. But it was a vintage Floyd Mayweather that turned up against Marquez. The stiff jab and quick hands never missed a beat, and it was not long before the Mex Mexican hit the canvas. After that, Mayweather won every single round of the fight, and the result was a foregone conclusion. An East London rower is determined to be the first African to cross an ocean solo. Peter van Ketz is taking part in the Woodvale Cross Atlantic boat race from La Gomera on the Canary Islands to the West Indies island of Antigua from the 6th of December this year. The race covers a distance of 5,500 kilometers across the Atlantic. Peter van Ketz and his rowing partner Bill Godfrey returned to South Africa as heroes after winning the Woodville Pairs event in December 2007 and January 2008. See for 50 days and 12 hours. This time, Van Kertz has chosen to go solo and wants to improve the record of 78 hours. Um, I have a target, and uh, it's, quite a, it's, quite a, it's quite a hard target to get to. It's 50 days. The race record is 78 days. And um, I'm planning to do it in 50. That means I've got to take 28 days off the record. If he finishes the race, he will be the first man to win the race both in pairs and solo. His plan is to roll for one and a half hours and then rest for the next one and a half hours. The race is unassisted. Once the gun goes, competitors are on their own. Yeah, a lot of people say, uh, Pete, aren't you scared when you do something like that? And I'd love to be able to tell them that, uh, no, I'm not scared. But... Um, there are terrifying moments. It's just, are you able to handle that fear? And uh, we proved that we could. We were quite happy, well, not happy, but I mean, we were able to handle the fear, and that's uh, something that I'm going to have to um, tackle when I get up. The boat, which has been specifically designed for this race, rides itself automatically if it goes underwater. It's fitted with a machine that changes seawater into drinkable water and has all the features of a red start ship. The boat's name is Nyamezela. A closer word that means see through hardship. Yeah. And that is what Van Kett's plans to do withstand the hardship and emerge triumphant. So, Andy Lynn River, Morning Live, East London. Sure, an amazing story, eh? Peter Van Kett's, good luck to you. Now, when you come back, Morning Live will declare that or boss Owen. <laughs> that was your sports news here on Morning Live. Headlines in a few moments at 7.30. For now, let's turn to Andile and get a sense of where the weather is going today. Andile, how's it going today? Well, it looks like there's a bit of relief, especially along the Modimelo Makopane area where there was a fire uh, raging in there. We hope, hopefully, the firefighters are winning in that regard. But other than that,